Speaker McCarthy, yes. um, former President Donald Trump threatened Mexico um, with the tariffs if they didn't do their part to secure the border when he was in office, and we did see this problem, you know, it got like better. Now, I'm wondering, what are you going to do about that? Are you going to do something similar, or how are you going to hold Mexico accountable for their part? Well, I'm not President of the United States, but the one thing I can be as Speaker of the House, I could put... I could change legislation and put it into law. Because right now, what has changed from President Trump to President Biden, there has been no legislation change. But why has the border, why has this region gone from 66,000 people coming across to 250,000? Why is everybody who comes across here wear camouflage outfits and rugs on their feet? Why are we catching so much fentanyl? The only thing that changed was the administration and the administration policies. So if you want to stop fentanyl, the first call you should make is to President Xi. It's exactly what I told President Biden inside the Oval Office the other week. Call President Xi and tell him to stop the chemicals coming down. If you want to stop the cartels, you got to be serious about it. These are terrorist organizations. Call them as such and take the action to stop them. They are making billions of dollars. They are human trafficking. What John told you, the rancher, he did not mention. His family has found 14 dead bodies on his ranch in just the last couple of years. Those are human bodies. He tells the story of his grandson smelling the body. It is different from a dead cow. Why is that happening? Because the administration's policies that is allowing it to happen. The administration, on the day President Biden was sworn in, when you look at the gaps in the wall, why are they there? Why are these lights wired but not working? because we got a new president that said to stop it. We paid for the metal to go up, but it's stored far away. There's gaps that allow it to come in. That's wrong. Why are they having Border Patrol agents becoming processing agents and taking away from the job they want to do that continues to harm the cartels able to watch and take advantage of it? So more drugs come into America that kill Americans. That has got to stop.